As someone who loves to make 3D scans, Bruh. I started wondering how I could use some a AI tools like Midjourney and Runway in a 3D workflow. So it got me thinking, what if I try to create turntable videos and use them inside Reality Capture to create a scan similar to any other scan workflow? So I wanted to start by making a simple environment prop similar to something from Quexel. Who don't like a good CG rock? I plugged this prompt into Midjourney, a photorealistic monolithic stone standing in the middle of a vast grassy field on a cloudy day, and it spit out a few different images. I chose this one because it looked cool and also because it had nice even lighting. Okay. All right, over to Runway where I took that there image and generated a video of it. Specifically, a video that orbits around the subject in a circular motion. In theory, this kind of coverage should be enough to generate a scan. I up that bad boy to 4K because quality matters. Shit was looking pretty spicy, so I downloaded it and brought the file into DaVinci for a quick sharpen. From here, I converted the video into a 16-bit frame-by-frame image sequence and imported that sucker into Reality Capture. Quick alignment step and... Oh, yeah, we got ourselves a sassy little point cloud. Bruh. Quick look at her, and we're getting somewhere. Next, the reconstruction step to build a model from the aligned images. I'm expecting the model to be pretty messy partner you better believe it was messy so i began cleaning the model of any artifacts pretty boring ain't it sometimes in life you gotta wrangle in those loose polygons floating around causing trouble because if you don't they'll come back and bite you in the ass <laughs> this i know It wasn't long before I had a clean model I could project the texture onto standard procedure for reality capture. Although, I did continue to refine the edges because they were looking pretty bad at this point. Well, I guess we can work with this. All things considered, it wasn't too bad, I guess. Details are a little tough to pick out right now, but maybe something's hiding in there. I went ahead and exported a FBX of the scan and prepared a new project in Unreal Engine 5. Set up a quick world with lighting and imported my FBX file. Boom. And just like that, we got ourselves a rock. I don't hate it. After a quick adjustment to the roughness map, we were sitting real pretty. Those little details come flying out at you fast, don't they, Slick? And well, you know how this story ends. You wander off into the endless maze of Unreal Engine, with its great open vastness, its unfiltered beauty. You tip your hat and remind the next fella that it's all a game, and we're just playing it. So make some shit and have fun, because it's all we got. I'll see you out there.